Hello guys, this reading is for my cancers. This is, um, we're going to see if the person that you're thinking about is coming back. Um, if that's what you're interested in. If it's not, you guys can go ahead and click off this reading because that is what this reading is all about. We're going to first try to see like where you guys are in respect to the other person. And, um, and then at the end of it, we'll pull a card to see if um if union is likely between the two of you for the month of june okay so let's see getting off to a rough start already here with these cards let's see what's going on currently with cancer what's going on with cancer currently and we have a three of chalices Hmm, that is your card there, Cancer, with the Three of Cups. Um, I feel like you guys are enjoying family time, um, enjoying time with your friends, even having drinks, socializing, getting out and getting some fresh air, um, just trying to be positive and uplifting is what I feel right now, okay? What's currently going on with the other person? What's currently going on with the other person? We have a Knight of Swords here, air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy here. Uh, somebody is not that happy, I feel, um, with what they notice or what they, uh, the information somebody has given them have come across. This person, I feel like, is, is in this confrontational mode right now. And they really want to say something to you about something that they've heard that you've done or what you're doing. Uh, somebody may have told them that that you are dating someone even. But I'm feeling like there's really confrontational energy coming from them and they want to break some shit up. I think you're having too much fun for them. Or either they feel like you're having too much fun for them. Um, not paying them enough attention and maybe you know spending more time with your friends and family. Okay. What does Cancer want? What does Cancer want? Ace of Cups here. Now, I do feel like you guys want something new. Um, or either you want, you know, the situation with this person to be revitalized. Maybe you want them to stop talking at you or stop trying to get you to do something by being overbearing or what have you. And you want them to uh, show up more emotionally. But definitely love is what you want. Okay. I feel like new love, revitalized love, a different kind of love even. What does this other person want? What does the other person want? Some of you are wanting to be by yourselves, I'm hearing. You just want to heal and just and just be by yourself for a little while. Even though you miss this person. This other person wants what they want. Seven of Cups, Seven of Chalices. They want their options open. They don't want you to have any options though here is the thing. They want you to miss them and they want to see that you miss them. Scorpio energy there. They want you to be one of their options. In other words. What does Cancer need? Hierophant. Stand up for what you believe. Don't waver from it. Okay. The Taurus energy. Speak your peace because you know what you want and you know what it takes to make you happy and you don't have to lower your standards for anybody. What does the other person need? What does the other person need? King of Swords. They need to grow up. They need to grow up. They need to stop talking with the flip tongue. Um, they need to show more control over themselves. They need to show up. Be a man. Or be a woman even. 
if this is a woman okay is there anyone else involved here with cancer is there anyone involved for cancer is there anyone involved for cancer I feel like if you want it to be <laughs> here with judgment is your call I feel like there's definitely somebody a potential in the picture um, but I think you're being very careful right now and how you step uh, I think you don't want to make the wrong decisions any longer you don't want to make the wrong choice um, you don't want to jump the gun you guys are seasoned you don't even have to be a 40 to be seasoned okay you could have gone through a whole lot of shit in your short life at 25 and be seasoned but the bottom line is you're not making a rush to judgment but I definitely get this is Scorpio energy I definitely get you're not um, counting anybody out but you're not counting anybody in either which leads me to believe that there is someone who you are not trying to rush into something with here okay you're just like <laughs> taking in all the compliments taking in all the looks taking in all of the um flirtatious gestures you're just taking it in yes here i am i know you like me because you're putting on some good energy some good vibes right now okay is there someone involved for the other person is there someone involved for the other person is there someone involved and we have the high priestess I feel like this person does have someone, someone that they're not um, serious with. And if they're, they are serious with this person, this person needs to check them because they are keeping them a secret. Okay. This is almost like that side check. Okay. So I do feel like there's somebody like a mistress or somebody that they don't necessarily um, want anybody else to know about. Um, yeah, this is Pisces energy here, the high priestess. I do feel like um, there's some sort of, um, uh, there's Gemini energy here too. But yeah, there, there's someone there that they don't want anyone to know about though. So, especially you. <clears throat> Is it likely that Cancer and their person will unite? Is union likely? Is union likely? And then we have a nine of chalices or nine of cups. Not likely for the month of June because nines and sevens are single energy you guys are meant to travel your own paths right now do what take do what it takes to make you happy please don't let this person bully you into doing something that you don't necessarily want to do at the moment because I feel like this person's coming in okay do what you need to do to be happy if you feel like you don't want to give um, to this situation right now, then don't do it. If you don't want to, if you feel like you don't want to get to this situation, period, don't do it. Do what your heart desires, and they should follow their heart as well. But as long as, um, as long, and I see them somewhat following their heart because the high priestess as well is about you know following your heart and following your intuition, doing what your heart. Um, it, you know it's leading you to do but there's somebody that they are hiding so they're still not necessarily doing you know right by someone so this person is going to have some um, some karma behind this we all have karma let's not mistake that we all have karma 
But when you intentionally do things that you know aren't necessarily right, you can't expect repercussions for that. It may not come back in a way that you feel like it should, but yeah, when shit starts going awry, then there you have it, okay? You get what you deserve, period, whether it's good karma or bad karma. So anyway, this is Pisces energy here with the Nine of Cups. That's what I have for you guys, and I'll be speaking with you guys soon.